two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Well, the reason why I'm doing this is to prove a point. Not everything on this channel is real. And a couple of weeks ago, it it was implied that I sniffed baking soda. No, not at all, because it was all off camera and all make believe, just like the movies. And, like everything else, I am a mature adult who has one of those silly sides. Now, if people don't like the silly side to my channel, then the channel's not for you. Public service announcement over with. Let's get on with the build. I should have said start scratching the build, but hey, never mind. So, this week is the last of the trilogy of mechs that I'm building. All inspired by Black Sabbath songs. So we had Warpigs, we've had Voodoo, and this time I'm making The Wizard, which is going to be a total different uh, sort of look to the other two. And as you can see, um, I'm just wiping down the table because uh, that was a terrible jump cut. I do apologise, uh, but it will come back eventually. This, there we go, Bosch. That's your milk bottle, um, and that is glue. And um, people keep asking me what sort of glue I use. This is the glue I get it from. Not sponsored by this company by any way, but I'm just going to show you what it is. I usually tear all the labels off, um, and it's from Screwfix over in uh, Ireland and the UK. And I find it's really good glue to use to, you know, glue things together with, obviously. So I'm using the same snap links as uh, I've used on the previous builds. So instead of me showing you all that bit, which is kind of boring, I'm going to address another elephant in the room. People keep asking me where George is. Well, George has been acting strange lately. Uh, in fact, he's taken up residence in my shed, which is kind of weird because I started out in my shed and I've moved to a garage and he's taken over the shed. So uh, look, I'll tell you what, let's go have a look and see if we can find George. One second. Let me just get the camera, come on, let's go outside. Oh, he's in here, I think. George, are you there? Where else would you think I'd be monkey boy? Oh, rude. Uh, what are you doing? I'm trying to hide from intergalactic forces from a different universe who want to take me away and use me for evil. Well, that's different. You want to say anything, George? To all the non-subscribers who watch this channel, why don't you subscribe and like? It's free and won't cost you any money, but really helps this channel. We would really appreciate it, you sexy peeps. Now, if you don't mind, I'm going back to hide. Okay, dude, chill your beans. Um, right, back with the build. Uh, anyway, why are you sat on a log? Because someone never built legs for me. Stay classy, all our subscribers. Bye. Miss you already. Ah, oh, that's really nice, George. It's almost as if you're going to be leaving soon. Okay, back to the build. So as you can see, I've given it like a spider pose. Um, and I'm just going to start attaching Greeblies, just like the other stuff uh, I've done before. Uh, just with a little bit of difference this time. Um, these are wall plugs that you get to put screws into walls. I'm going to chop them in half and use them just to uh, greeble up the legs. And next I just used the beads just to um, look like rivets and did that all on the uh, legs. Next I dug out some armature wire um, and just cut off a couple of pieces and wrap some thinner wire around this thicker wire um, just to look like it was cables coming from the main body down to the legs. Simple as. And as you can see, I used the wall plugs, just put the wire through the wall plug and glued it into place. Next, it was the main body of the build, which is going to be two of these cheapest chips um, FX model kits got these from what the American viewers would know as a dollar store 
we know it over here as a euro store or a pound store uh, they're a little bit more than a pound or a euro but uh, they're still cheaper than uh, the main ones that you could get from Amazon I uh, bought two simply because I was going to use or will be using the wings um, and I wanted uh, two sets of them so I just got busy snip snip snipping away and uh, taking everything off the sprues then it was just a simple task of trying to find pieces to cover all the gaps of the uh, mug bottle finally decided to use this mini um, been sat in the bits box for months and months and months and uh, put my big boy pants on and started cutting it down to use finally on this model while well, I chopped that down and um, oh yes now this is a um, a flamethrower it's a lighter flamethrower doesn't work anymore fell off an old model thought I'd repurpose it stuck it on this one now let's speed everything up and do a quick montage of me sticking pieces together And here is the final product. This is the wizard mech, all greebled up. And put the wings on the top, on the top. Gee, I should really start scripting this. Put the wings on the back uh, to make it look like it was a uh, Gumpla uh, build. Once the gray primer had dried, it was then onto the airbrush and I'm gonna use blue first. Or I decided to paint the legs red and the rest of it white and if nobody's guessed yet that is the colors for the British flag um, since Black Sabbath is technically a British band I uh, decided to make uh, the wizard British and there we go there's a flag that I put on top uh, that actually came with the uh, mini kit then I applied the weathering like I was wearing uh, Mike Tyson's uh, boxing glove and then it was on to the glamour shots so like subscribe keep an eye out for May the 4th Dude, it's over. It's done. The video's done. Maybe use it for next week then as everyone skips through to the end anyway. Yeah, you have a point. Yeah, good thinking. Yeah, I'll do that. Keep it for next week.